Hello everybody, Kiwa here with another Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes Grand Arena. My opponent today is Cyril. They are with the Seekers of Jedi. I swear I just battled someone from there. That sounds super familiar. <laughs> no, that might have even been last round. <laughs> I already forgot. <laughs> they already battled me, and this is where we're at. Didn't switch up the defense at all. Let's see. Horse ships, nothing. I don't expect anything from ships. And my hope is just to steal a few banners. And then over here, Ray with the massive hold. Curious as to what they used. And then at the bottom, boom! Finn and Zori coming in clutch. That was huge. That was big. Ray and Finn and Zori. All right. This is what we got in front of us. We got some Darth Vader. We got some Hondo, Aiden. So we got some Qui-Gon and CLS. And then at the bottom, after I continue to look through these, we have, oh, I can see it. We got a Jabba. We got Beck, we got DTMG, we got the Trench, and we got the Ray. Uh, I didn't have a chance to record this live, so these are going to be just the battles. All right, we're going up against Ray. We're bringing in Seer Malico, so I'm trying this without the Star Killer to see if it will work or not. All right, let's throw it. <laughs> Nice, nice stun. All right, let's go do that. Let's get it, uh, Ray. What? Why is there already a whirlwind? I guess she was below the threshold. All right. All right, basic. Um, we're going to heal up here. I don't know. Seer's looking kind of low. All right, let's hear it all up. All right, Malakos is just too powerful. I thought Ray was going to go in the ultimate right here. That's why I attacked. That's why I went after Ben. I thought she was... I was not expecting another whirlwind. That was a bad call on my part. And then Ben comes in and just smacks me. So now we got to hopefully tank... This ultimate. This thing would have played out so much differently if if I would have, I guess, actually looked to see if she was an ultimate. We tank it. Alright, boom. Boom. You know what's coming next. We're throwing rocks. <laughs> Goodbye, Ben. We don't get Ray out. So whirlwind's coming. See, if she wouldn't have killed Seer earlier, Seer would have been okay. She would have been alive. And we would have had all three of us alive. So, I think a little bit of a misplay on my part. But, oh well. Alright. I didn't want to do the two shot just because of how well they did. So, I wanted to give this a, a go. Sid Solo up against DTMG. All comes down to the dots. Can we get the five dots? At least on his basic, it is, it can't be resisted. So, doesn't really matter how much tenacity or tenacity they have. Can be evaded though, so if they have foresight or whatever. All right. Boom, goodbye. Now I feel good after that. Once, uh, DTMG's down. I felt pretty good. Sorry, I had it in airplane mode and stuff, so that's why there's a little bits of cuts. I cut out the airplane mode part where I was going into that on my screen. All right. Let's whirl it. Yeah, you can just get out of here, Dark Trooper. And... And... Nope, not dead yet. Still trying to get me out. 
<laughs> they just both checked out. Got a nice 59 right there. That was huge. That was huge. All right. Let's get on to the next one. JMK versus Jabba. Um, so I think I might play this differently next time. Oh, just because of it's the R9, Chris, Santon, and I can get after Leia pretty easily. Um, so I do have like some deflection on this Kron. So I think that helps, especially up against Leia. But like there, I wish I would have, I'm saving the insta kill for once I get into alt. I was going to use it on Leia. But I think that just, um, I think that plays into how this battle goes. Okay, yeah, she just keeps going. So, I get her out, but Chris being the tank that he is. Okay, so that was just before the four minute mark. And I feel like I'm never gonna get through Chris Santon. Boom, look at that, barely does anything. I mean, we're gonna ramp up, but are we gonna be able to ramp up enough to like with the insta kill, we already killed him. He wouldn't have had all this stuff, and when he comes back, it's not the same for Santon. So, and I could have killed Leia in the meantime. All right, <laughs> we haven't even got to his just his health yet. All right, let's try again. We've been uh, just pounding on him for almost a minute now, and we haven't even gotten through his protection part yet. I mean, meanwhile, Jabba is like building up its alt. And again, nothing. Alright, let's protect you. Oh my goodness. We're still not through protection yet. <laughs> so thick, Chrysanthemum. Alright. Let's keep going. And alright, we're making progress. Making a little bit of progress. Come on. Yes! Finally! A minute and a half later. And yay! We're ramping up. I look at look at Jabba's alt there. And it's gonna come down. Alright, good. Santa's finally gone. Who is Jabba? Are we gonna be able to get Jabba out before he he alts. All right, here we go. Come on. It's getting close. Come on, big hit. We need the big smacker. Come on, come on, come on. Here we go. No, not enough. Oh no, he's ready for alt. <clears throat> come on, come on. Let's go. Come on, we're almost there. He's ready. No. That was, that was rough. What if you would have ate cat? That would have been a whole different ball game. As long as he ate GK or tried to eat JMK, we were fine. All right, I didn't know what to use on trench. So I was thinking how oh, Wampa Solo would be cool, but I, again, I just, I had to be, I had to try to be as clean as possible in order to win this, this match. So I, I gamble, I'm like, I'm gonna take in JML, I'm not gonna play around with it. Trench right now, I don't think is a joke. Um, so that's why I opted for, wanted to see what was on that back wall without dropping any battles. So that was the reason for Sid instead of the Padme two shot. Um, that's why I wanted to try Sid. I heard it worked really well, and it did. And this is why I decided with what I still had, because I still had have SLKR, I still have C, I still have Bane, um, all for 
the uh, back wall for whatever might be back there. So I thought we were set up pretty well even with using JML here. All right, nice solid victory. I should be considering that. All right, Beck, I still don't know what to use for Beck. I was told that Qui-Gon's good, so I'll have to see what the history shows on that. If it is, I might take Qui-Gon off of defense. I think that's an awesome trade instead of trying to use um, like Reva here when Reva could be used for, I don't know, I guess right now Beck is a tough team. So I don't know. I have to, have to, I don't, I just don't know like what other team out there can mess with Beck right now. I think Reva's the best, best way to go. Um... At the moment, I usually say I was saving Reva for for Saw, but it seems like Maul and the Mandos are doing awesome up against Saw right now. All right, we are through the back wall. We got Zori, we got Afra, Saw, Tuscans, and Rex. Um, Afra, this will be a first. I'm not sure. I might put Afra on defense because I haven't even used her at all. She hasn't been on defense and I've been saving her for offense and I haven't used her on offense that I can think of. Because I don't know what I can trust her with. Alright, here we go. Speaking of Maul and the Mandos, we're going to give it a go again. This all has the Omicron, so I didn't even think about that. Because what does it do? It messes up cooldowns. So I'm gonna start out. Look at those. Look at those guys. See? I can't get that first off. So I have to make a decision here. They did a good job on base. So I'm trying to decide do I just want to go use that? And I decide, yep, let's just get Baze out of here. Let's see if we have enough damage to get Churret out. Boom, we do. So that was good to know for the future. So if I face an Amasaw again. I'm just basically going to try to do the same setup. Alright, let's see if we can get through. One more hit. Oh, did it? Did it? Yes. I'm going to try to work on my Mando to see if I can get him maybe a little bit more powerful. Alright. Going up with Aiden up against CLS. I think this is a kind of a good trade. Especially with the uh, Empire... DC and I do have the Death Trooper one so I think even if they do kill Death Trooper he comes back anyway which I really like right now because just in case CLS does happen to take a big hit on death uh, we get to have him come back all right boom big hit you're gone easy 57 Bringing up in Adrad up against Aiden. This battle scares me because <laughs> if they go after Radis, uh, that's ball game. And Stormtrooper can hit hard. All right. Good. We got the stun on Stormtrooper. That's now we gotta try to get range. Unfortunately, he's gonna come back if we kill him now. I'm going to deal with these counterattacks, and I think, yeah, that's an R8 range too, so that's not a joke range. Alright, let's see if we can get this, oh, oh, Jin with the big smack. Alright, let's go, boom. Cassian's going to look at Storm, just smack him. Alright, we got the stun, but unfortunately it's gone already. Man, this is scary. This is too scary. And with the doubt. Wait, is this a doubt crime? Yeah, this is a doubt crime. Alright. And Cassian's gone again. Like, I don't know. We better have a tank in here. I don't know if Cassian really does that much in this battle. I'm almost wondering if... Uh, Uh, some sort of tank K2. I don't know if he'd be good or not. Alright, let's rain it down. Boom! See ya, Aiden. 
There, Cassian's doing something now. <laughs> See, Cassian comes with nothing. He's like, don't worry. I'll come in when I need to. All right, we're going to go Supreme Leader Kylo up against Ben and Zori. I was going to use Starkiller. I um, was a little concerned um, with this Kron. Resistance Kron. Um, and I have Supreme Leader Kylo. I felt this was a one of the tougher battles left, so I want to not use Supreme Leader Kylo there just to be sure. All right, we got Trey up against Tuscans. This is going to be, I don't know, I don't think I've ever lost this battle, so we should be good. We just need to have Nihilus do his thing and insta kill people. All right, go ahead, sucking that away. Savage tanking it up. We just need, as long as Savage tanks with some protection up, I think we'll be all right. Okay. Go strip that away, reduce our cooldowns. Um, basic. Boom. Hang in there, Nihilus. All right. Doing that again. Savage. Oh, no. We got doubt. That's not good. Nihilus. Well, talk about timing. Savage had doubt. Couldn't taunt. No boss. I left Nihilus open for the one time where he's ready to do a big smack. Like, I thought that was a guaranteed win. Well, that messes things up. So we're going to bring in Bane. <laughs> Bane is like us. <laughs> he almost wipes out the whole team. <laughs> With the first move. <laughs> well, that was a fast battle. So that messes everything up. I was going to use Bane for other things. Like, I was maybe going to use him up here against Rex, maybe. I don't know. There's a lot of options for, for Bane. That messes up what I was planning for what I had left. All right, so we're bringing in C solo up against Rex. Can't believe Trey lost. That was just like the perfect timing and setup. It was like, it was almost like they were cheating, man. AI was cheating. CG hacked me. I mean, that was like perfect timing for the other team with everything. All right. Um, not sure why I didn't just go into ultimate there. Hmm. I guess maybe I wanted to try to heal up more. I don't know, or maybe I just didn't pay attention and see it. I have no idea. I don't. I honestly don't know what my thought process was there holding out. All right. You're still alive, and now you're not. Okay, I decided to go with the good old Dash Han Chu versus Afra, hoping that we could blitz down Afra. All right, come on, Dash. There we go. We did it. We did it. That was nice. Okay, you're gone. So we can stun. We got it. Boom. Out. 56. Not bad. We got Malgus coming up. All right, we just need to keep the team feared and I think we'll be all right. Let's see if we can get Qui-Gon out right now. Boom, nope, not yet. And boom, nope, not yet. And still not yet. And still not yet. All right, boom, finally, oof. Oh, we got the heal immunity on it. Come on. Oh, we got to get him out. We got to get him out. Come on. Boom. That's good. There we go. We should be all right now. Can we get healed up more, though? Come on, Cam. Tank it. Nope, we're not going to do the big hit. Yeah, we'll do that. Let's, there we go. Let's heal up. That's what I'm talking about. 
No, I just smack him now. Okay, we got a 56. Bring in the Star Killer. Star Killer action up against the Bam and the Hondo. Of course, he goes right on to. I guess that's probably a good thing that I wasn't on Star Killer. I don't know. I'm not really sure the best way to go. We just gotta make sure Bam doesn't get too many stacks. Oh, was it the shock that stopped him from triggering the him going? Uh, oh, almost lost MJ. Healing immunity is not good. All right, Mara J finally gets to play the game. All right, Bam is out. Now we gotta worry about Hondo. He might just go crazy. Come on. All right, can we get some stuns? We got the stun. All right, let's base. All right, wow. Nice job. Still got the healing immunity, so not much I can do there. We got 52. Yikes. That went a lot. Not as good as I hoped. All right, bringing in the Jedi. Man, that was fast team. Because my team is like. Jedi Revan is not slow. He's what, 327? Plus the bonuses? Man, Vader and Thrawn got out before me. Alright. Alright, well, the biggest threat's gone, so they really don't have any more damage at this point. Just a matter of getting through shore. Um, can we heal up a little bit? Okay. Can we get 56? Yeah, alright, that's fine. And we are through onto the ships. And I'm not going to commentate with the ships. You can watch the ship battles. Here's what we have. And you can probably guess how the outcome is. So enjoy. Thank you so much, Cyril, for the wonderful match. Stressing me out, especially after the Nihilus Treya fail versus the Tuscans. I was shocked with that one. I wish I would have recorded my face as soon as that happened. As soon as Nihilus just got destroyed, I was like, uh, okay, what do I do now? Because that was like one of the sure battles I thought I had towards the end there. And then I could have used Bane for whatever I had questions I had left. Luckily, everything worked out fine, so we are all good. Everyone have a fantastic day and night, wherever you might be. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And if you can pass on my channel to your guild and your friends, I would greatly appreciate it. Please leave a thumbs up. Kiwi is out.